just gotta fiddle with some settings before I start playing. Oh, okay, that's not really what I was expecting to happen. Let me just turn that back. Oh, oh, God, what have I done? Uh, can I please just go back to being able to see? Oh, God damn it, why does everything I touch have to turn to shit? So I've actually had this game for quite a while, but only just now decided to download it, and I gotta say, right off the bat, it, uh, it, it really, it's really, well, this might be one of the best games ever made. So the rules of this game are real simple. It's a PvP arena type game where all you gotta do is kill the enemy team to win. You just have to remember your click move, your other click move, your spacebar ability, your Q, your E, your R, your ultimate, what all of the alt versions of those abilities do when holding shift, and you only have to do that for 23 different characters. Now your average simpleton might lack the required gray matter for this, but for a true and honest Rick and Morty connoisseur such as myself, this is a piece of cake. Matter of fact, boom, look at that. I have now fully mastered battle right. Let's get into it. As we all know, the best way to choose your main in a video game is to pick the character you want to have sex with the most. So we're just gonna start by doing this, and great, let's see what we've got left. There's Titorial Girl, One Thick Bih, Diva without her mech suit, Tummy Lady, Covering Too Much, Not Sure If You're Legal, Definitely Not Legal, and finally... Yep, okay, found my main. Now a lesser gamer would probably go into practice mode or read a guide or something like that before playing a character they have zero knowledge of, but a true gamer such as myself only needs one thing. Complete dedication to my wife. From what I'm seeing, Blossom is a character that I can really get behind in more ways than one. Supports that are able to dish out big heals and do big damage are right up my alley. Some might say, she protect, she attack, but most importantly, I wanna have sex with her. Round one. What a beautiful sight. You know what? I think I've found it. I think I've found my one true calling in life. I'm just gonna become a professional battle right player. I mean, YouTube is dying, chances are this video is gonna get hit with the yellow dollar sign of death, and I could really use a new source of income. So starting now, I am a free agent. TSM, C9, I know you're out there watching. Feel free to hit me up anytime. Oh, Jesus Christ, I still really don't know what any of the enemy characters do. All I know is that as the healer, I really don't want to stand next to any of them. Ooh, look at that. See ya later, bucko. Not even close. You can never kill me. I'm good at this. I agree, wife. Oh, well, what's not good is getting trapped in a corner by the entire fucking enemy team. I'm really not liking the looks of this one. Match lost. TSM, C9. Please still sign me. Well, despite taking the massive L, at least I got a loot box from that game, so I can't be too upset. Let's open it up and see what fantastic prizes we get. <laughs> really? This game knows exactly what it's doing. Now don't get me wrong, Blossom is always gonna be my one true main. But Boomerang Girl over here, I also like Boomerang Girl a lot, so let's try her out, why don't we? Part of me does feel bad for chewing up the time of five strangers by not readying immediately, but I've got 60 seconds to learn how this character works, and I can't not take it, I'm sorry. Alright, so check it out. From what I've gathered, Boomerang Girl, get this, throws a boomerang and does damage with it. Also, her ultimate summons a rideable goat for some reason. I'm really not sure what the lore reasoning behind that one is, but I can't complain since it's pretty badass. So it's legitimately been about 20 seconds and their last guy has two HP left and is just running around the map like a chicken with his head cut off. Here's a quick PSA etiquette lesson that can be applied to any online game, really. If you're gonna lose, please do everyone a favor and just lose. Ooh, sorry, bud. Looks like we've got your corner. There's no way you're gonna get away from us this time. Oh, 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 he got away again. God damn it. Don't be like this guy. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen, a 100% win rate with Taya. I am officially the best player in the world. Feels pretty good, man. Now, I already know that I'm gonna get bombarded with comments screaming at me to play the extra thick girl, 
So let's just go ahead and pick her to prevent that from happening. Wow, look at that. What do you even need those hammers for? Just kill everyone by whacking them with your hair. <laughs> this is my first time playing a melee character, and it's very scary. I don't want to have to get up close and personal. I just want to kill dudes from a million miles away like a little baby. Dear Lord in heaven, get me the fuck out of here. Okay, see, we're fine. Everything is fine. She can never catch me. All right. You hate to see that happen. I mean, hey, we're still killing it, though. Definitely not because I'm getting carried, but because we are all equally great at this video game. Just you wait, Pearl, I'm coming for you. Boom! Take your ass back to Splatoon 2, you stupid little goblin! Nobody will ever love you! Match victory. Hooray! You ever wonder what the love child of D.Va and Mega Man would look like? Well, now you know. I beat. Okay, our team has like no health and we're on the verge of losing. I sure do hope my ultimate does something useful. What is this? Okay, well that just happened. Still lost that match though, that sucks. So this character has like a Yasuo wind wall that blocks all incoming projectiles, which makes sitting back and being out of harm's way real easy. I sure do love being able to completely shut down an entire archetype of character every 10 seconds. I'm so sorry, Blossom. I still love you, you know it. But I gotta snipe your head off. I don't got a choice. God damn, this character is really good. Even when melee characters try to fuck with you, all you gotta do is counter, and then they just fall apart. Let me just get this Blossom kill and this Sword Guy kill, I don't know his name, and do most of the damage to this enemy destiny. Bada boom! I I love this character, man. She's so good. Game point. Here we go. Don't worry, team. I got this. Pinball powers activate. He okay. That didn't work. Uh, remember how I said that this character is good at staying out of harm's way? Player like that. Don't run into all three of the bad guys. But hey, don't worry. We still got the W though. I love the smell of chemistry. Okay, cool. Let's give Riku from Final Fantasy X a try then, shall we? So this character is kind of like Twitch from League of Legends, but probably smells a whole lot better. When you're not poisoning the enemy team with your crossbow, like a communist leader dealing with journalists, you're either healing your dudes with good potions or hurting the enemy dudes with bad potions. Pretty simple. Pretty fun. Okay, I immediately take it back. I'm not having fun anymore. We've just been running around the map trying to kill this stupid little ghoul for the past 10 hours. I just want the pain and suffering to come to an end. Yes! Thank you, good lord in heaven! Fuck you, Fizz! Guys, I've got great news. You are not going to believe this. Well, you probably will. It's not really that crazy. As I was editing this video, a hot new patch came out bringing an all new character. I just gotta say, whoever's in charge of character design for this game, give that person a raise immediately. They're doing a good job. So very fittingly for the winter season, Alicia is ice ice baby and extremely nice nice baby. If perfection didn't already exist in the form of a sexy deer lady, then this would 100% for sure be my main. I'm not a furry, by the way, I promise. You know, now that I think about it, this character is pretty much what you would get if you built Blossom solely for offense. I think that's why I have such a strong affinity for her. But don't worry, guys, there's no way that I would ever cheat on my wife with another woman. I mean, who the hell do you think I am? Dr. Disrespect? If you want big damage and CC for days while also being able to support your frontliners as well as yourself with a big meaty shield, then this is definitely the character for you. So, yeah, that's basically Battle Right. I know I miss playing as Covering Too Much Girl, but to be honest, she just didn't look very interesting to me. And I also skipped playing as Pearl, because I just made an entire video about a lolly, man. I don't need to spend any more time in court over virtual little girls, you have to understand. Will I ever make another video on this game? I don't know. Maybe. Depends on how much you guys want it. Considering it's not Smash, however, I'm gonna assume most people just won't really care. Okay, that's my fun video about a fun video game. I love you. Oh, also, I guess now is the best time to do the whole shill thing, so, alright, check it. I'm like a thousand subscribers away from 200,000, and I'd really like to hit that by the end of the year, so I'm gonna need all of you to go ahead and subscribe if you haven't already, and also share my shit with everyone you know. A parent, a teacher, a police officer, it don't matter. Make me famous, please, okay? I really appreciate all of your viewership and support. I love you all. Again. Mwah.